Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Namo and you are watching Vocabulary Practice with Namo. In today's video, I am just going to give you most important tip that really help you to be fluent in English. So without wasting so much time, let's dive into the video. First of all, I just want to ask you one question. How much time you give to yourself for practice English speaking? I am asking again, how much time you give it to yourself for practice English speaking? I am not talking about how much time you are watching English content. I am not talking about how much time you are listening English content. I am not asking how much time you are writing English in English content. I am asking you how much time you give it to yourself for practice English speaking. If you know the answer, please comment me in a comment section below. If you are still in a confusion that what you should do, you can't learn English speaking. I am really sorry to say that, but it is the truth. If you just are came here for watching English content in YouTube, if you don't like that, whatever I am telling you, maybe so many times I am just asking you, I am just telling you that you have to, if you really want to speak English, you have to practice English speaking. When you came again, I am asking you again that if you want to speak English, you have to practice English speaking. And you are thinking, I don't, I don't know much about things. I just have one word and I am asking you again and again. Maybe so many of viewers are escaped my video. They are watching other video that how to be fluent in English. Maybe other trainer can tell you what is the best way to be fluent in English without practice English speaking. I just want to tell you one thing that if you really want to be fluent in English, there is only one way. You have to practice English speaking. That is a universal truth. Maybe you can't deny, maybe you can deny the fact that why I need to speak in, in English. I just want to give you example. Suppose that you are thirsty. What you are going to do? You are going to take a food to eat that can help you to drench your thirst. Tell me that can help you to drench your thirst if you are going to take a food to eat. No. If you want to drench your thirst, you have to drink water. That is the only way. So if you want to learn, if you want to speak in English, you have to practice English speaking, guys. Why you are not thinking about that? Why you are watching every English content, every videos about how to speak in English, but you are not going to take it very seriously that you have to practice English speaking. I just want to tell you, don't miss the bus. It is the opportunity to speak fluent English with the help of practice English speaking. Maybe if you are not getting it right now, maybe you feel regret when the time is over. You are just thinking that time, why I am not follow that step the person is telling me. I am not talking about me. I am talking about if you are watching other videos. If someone is telling you that you have to speak English, you have to practice English speaking. That is the only way. If I don't want that anybody who can learn English speaking can't learn speaking. I just want that one day you can came here and comment me, sir, just because of you, just because of your tips, I really love to do that and I am now I am really fluent in English. I can speak in front of anyone. I don't need someone that can tell me that what you should do, what you should not do. So that is really one. In every English learner, every English trainer who just want that you have to speak English, they are really want that you can learn English speaking. That's why we are every time we are emphasize that you, if you want to speak English, you have to practice English speaking. You have to speak every single day. You have to be consistent. I just want to tell you that's I am today. I am taking, I am talking about a carrot and stick approach. 
carrot and stick approach means that when i am my mom says to me that you are you need to go to market to buy something and i am not going to market i am just ignoring it my mom is very harsh so she is going to scold me then i realize that i have to go market why because we are take it everything lightly but when we are thinking that it is really important and it is really serious matter now i have to do it what my mom said I, we are doing it so in this video i am going to adopt carrot and stick approach what approach is that if you are going to follow my tips and you can learn english speaking i always praise you i always saying that you are the best viewers you are the best learner who can follow my tips but if you are not going to do it whatever i said that you have to practice english speaking and you are just listening my video you are just watching my video but you are not going to follow my tips i always i am not going to tell you that you are going good i am not praising you i am i can praise you only when when you are doing the right way at the right time at the right thing and i just want to emphasize you again i am going to emphasize this thing again that if you want to learn english speaking you have to practice english speaking i just want that don't be procrastinate don't take it very lightly don't be procrastinate please come out of your comfort zone no one can teach you no one can tell you that if without going to speak you can learn english speaking you can't no one can teach you that without practice english speaking you can be fluent no one can and no one can telling you you have to practice english speaking just you have to practice english speaking you have to stand in front of the mirror you are going to alone you have to speak english with yourself with someone else but you have to be consistent if you want to be fluent in english you have to practice english speaking if you are not going to do it right now just try to take it as a challenge that from today now i am going to speak english every single day i am not saying that you have to give yourself half an hour no just give you 10 minutes but you have to be consistent just do it for 30 days and telling me if you are not improving while speaking english never come to watch my video i just want to tell you just take it as a challenge that you have to follow this is the tips that you have to practice english speaking for consistently 30 days if you not improving while speaking english don't come and watch my video again just avoid me ignore me but try to follow this i will make sure i will definitely it is a universal truth if you speak practice speaking in english you can be fluent in english but it just depends upon you how much time you give it to yourself and how serious you are and i just want to emphasize this again and again if you want to be fluent in english there is only one way you have to practice english speaking don't watch more and more videos that how to be fluent in english try to follow the step whatever i am telling you whatever your trainer is telling you whatever the other youtuber who going to help you that how to be fluent in english are telling you just follow the step there is only one way if you are follow that that step maybe you are can learn or maybe you not there is no much harm that you can forget everything so just try take it as a challenge and i will make sure that you will be fluent in english and i am waiting for the moment when you came here and comment me sir just because of your tips now i am fluent in english i can speak better and better and every single day that is the time i have so much relief i am really happy for all of you that at least you can learn just because of me if any single person are going to tell me that i really love your video and now i am fluent while speaking english that is a day that 
why I make this video. That is the only reason I am emphasize you again and again. Maybe so many of my viewers not like this video. They feel that I have so much arrogance. I have so much ego. I am humiliating you. No, my intention is not like that. I just want that you will be fluent in English. But there is only one way. You have to practice English speaking every single day with consistency just follow these tips for 30 days just because of me if you are not learning until 30 days if you are not learning in 30 days that how to speak english don't come to watch my videos again and don't tell anyone if you are going to follow and you love it try to share my videos but watch full and, and try to learn why I am making this video for all of you. I hope that you like my content. If you have any suggestion, just comment me and tell them others that why you need to follow this step. Do take care of yourself. Till then, bye bye. Jai Hind, Jai Bhai.